you know, another Kevin, another question we get is um, why are guys waiting so long to get married? And that's you know, right now we're in a we're in a I, I guess for lack of a better word, a deep recession. Yeah. Um, yeah. So you can see where guys might want to wait, mm-hmm. given that they don't have a job, right. maybe their wife to be doesn't have a job, but but the trends have been over the past thirty years that the the average age of of guys and girls getting married is, is was like 22 mm-hmm. and now it's like for, for guys at least it's 27 okay why do you uh, why do you think that is couple it, yeah it, it particularly got you know uh, you know women really want to know I mean what I mean is there something that they're doing or yeah my opinion on a couple different levels I think the whole socialization of people t- leads to delaying of the maturity process. How so? Um, I hear stories from people about how college kids can't do things by themselves. They have to have their parents call them all the time and they can't fill out, co- uh, high school kids can't fill out college applications. Their parents have to do it for them. I mean, there's just delayed maturation process which leads to people getting married later on one level I think it may be part of it another level is there has been over the last 30 years um, a trend towards postgraduate education to MBAs law degrees uh, medical degrees all kinds of advanced degrees above college college is not the terminal degree anymore, mm-hmm. you know, the postgraduate degree. So that delays kind of like starting your life, if you will, okay. three to four to five years later. So, so I that, think so that's, that's kind of a good thing. Too. It could be a good thing. I think the real issue, I mean, what is the barometer of quality relationships? Is it the length of marriages? I mean, if you look at the divorce rate, you could argue that that's a barometer that things aren't as good as they might have been before. Sure. There's pros and cons on that or whatever, but, I mean, I don't know. Somebody used to get married at 22. College was finished at 22, so you started your life right. after college. Now you finish college, but you really have the necessity to go on, get more education, to really have a solid career. That's probably it more than anything else, I would guess. So a combination of just... Uh, uh getting more education, maturity levels. Mm-hmm. So you're, I mean, from that's from that aspect, I mean, it's really not a, I mean, it, it, it could really be a good thing. I, mean, I you, think it you, could be. You probably should wait to, to your, if you're going to mm-hmm. marry a guy, you should probably wait till he's reached a certain maturity level anyway. I would think, I would think. Yeah, they know themselves better and they can be a better partner. 